Hello, my name is Andrea Biederman, and I am a member of the Piano Teachers Federation. My professional education is still in progress. I am still studying my ARCT with Dr. Carla Dodek, and my theory teacher is Debbie Choit. I've been teaching piano for 10 years now. I did not anticipate that actually I would ever be a teacher. Even though I'm a mom and, uh, you know, love children, um, my teacher that I would really consider my first teacher said, what do you think about teaching? I kind of went, okay, <laughs> let's go ahead and give it a try. At that point that I started teaching, I honestly felt that my teachers at that point were able to give me the tools and the skills to be able to pass on to my students. I'm really not a method book teacher at all. I believe that they're limiting and they really don't set, I think for me, big enough goals. If um, you have a student who says, okay, this week we're learning this piece, next week we're learning this piece, next week we're learning this piece, they're really not understanding to me what music is all about. So I always start out with um, incredibly important technique, really understanding their body, how does it move, understanding what it is that we're doing with our hands and what it is that we're doing with our bodies in order to make the music. And actually the technique that I start with is legato. It helps them really understand the whole dynamics of what it is that we're doing with our hands in order to create the music. The notes and counting and all those things, I think, they just come. I bring in Kabaleski, I bring in Tasman, I like Bella Bartok. I also bring in boogies. Boogies teach them lots about rhythm and counting and all that kind of stuff. I have lots of music at home that I say, what about this piece and what about that piece? And if they really like it, then that is a huge thing. Because nothing is worse than doing a piece saying, you're doing this because I said so. That's boring. <laughs> I want to provide a warm and caring environment because the end result is the communication that we have in a positive and caring and warm manner in order to achieve whatever goal that student happens to want for how long that student happens to be with you. And then with hard work and solid foundation and good teaching and of course the support of background, you will be able to achieve those goals and take those goals wherever you want. I have a family that they went to Europe and they were playing their pieces for everybody with it memorized, amazing, and they had fun, and their parents are so proud of their children that they kind of smile, and that's really a joy for me completely, is to make the family and the students smile because they were able to achieve something that was incredible. That's it. <laughs> Thank you so much for this time, and I really look forward to meeting you and your family Whatever the age, whoever it is, I really am looking forward to meeting you and I wish you all a great day. Thank you very much.